I, th I think people in Japan so far have looked at it as, a, as more of like design and culture magazine from America, but I don't think they've really looked at it as Asian American, although they identify me as Asian American, which is kind of cool because uh, I think for the longest time in Japan, people would look at a, a Japanese American person and, th and I don't know, it seemed like they would kind of like, I don't know if they had disdain, but it didn't seem like it was uh, as respected as if I were not Japanese American. But it seems like, like my friend in Japan once told me that a magazine like Giant Robot does help Japanese people look at Asian American people and kind of understand that, you know, we're a big part of pop culture and culture in general in America, that it's really important. Asian Americans do count too. It's not just, you know, the Marlboro Man. <laughs> it does count. So I think my friend, my friend might have maybe had a point and I, I'm glad to be part of that because I always thought that I always felt that Asian Americans got overlooked by Asian people in general.